Hello everybody, Jimmy is Promo here back again with another awesome video. And in today's video, we will be talking about a small little change or upgrade that happened inside of your game launcher, more specifically inside of your game tools on what happens if someone calls or texts you during a game. Now, this one will be a quick and short video, but I think it needs to have a dedicated video just because the thing that you are playing your video game on is your main source of contact for calls and messages. Now to turn on and activate Game Launcher and use all these useful features, you do want to go inside of your settings, scroll down to where it says the advanced features, and then this is where you'll see the option of games. And once you turn this on, it's basically letting you know that you'll be able to have all of your games go to one place, which is inside of one folder that provides these additional features. Now in this video, I will not be doing the full tutorial of the game tools or the game launcher, which that will be the next uploaded video coming up here in just a second. But I wanted to have a dedicated video Video talking about these notifications because this one is the most change or notable change that happened inside of the game tools. Now, first off, let's just say that you actually have this one turned off. So now what'll happen is you will get alerts during your game play. So if we are playing this game over here and let's say that somebody wanted to send us over a text message, which I'm going to send a text message to myself, you'll actually see your, your edge lighting. You're also going to see everything pop up and that is a text message. Now, if somebody was to call you, then what's going to happen is you'll see a much bigger pop-up that will happen. Now you can see this is a much bigger square, a much bigger surface area overtaking your gameplay. It stopped the music in the background and then you are now ringing as a phone call. And then now if we were to head over here, which all you have to do to activate this is by swiping up from the very bottom and you'll open up the game tools, which is this icon over here. And then now you're able to turn on the no alerts during the game, but there's two different ways of having it pop up. The first one will be a small little floating pop up. The other one will be in the notification only. So first off, let's look at that floating pop up. Now, what I will show you here is I'm going to actually send myself another text. Now I did just send myself a text message. There was no ding, no vibration. There was no pop-up, but you will see it in the notifications panel on the very top. Now I'm gonna show you what it looks like when you get a phone call because this change is really talking mostly about when you're receiving a phone call, not really a text message. Text message might not be as important as a phone call just because if someone sends you a text message about four or five times, if you didn't respond, they're gonna call you, meaning it is a emergency. Now I did just call myself with that floating pop-up icon option. It vibrated one time. There is no ringtone as well as no game audio at this moment in time. You have three options. You can either answer, put on speakerphone, or you can decline the call. Now, if you answer it, you're still able to play your game, do anything and everything that you would want to from before without having the inconvenience of everything showing you that you're inside of a phone call. Now, the nice thing that is cool about this one is on the very top, it does have the little green bar letting you know that you are active in a phone call, but it is not overtaking your game play. Now, let's say that we want to look at that other option. So now if you go over here, go back inside of the little game tools and you open up that no alerts during the game if you go to in notification only then what will pop up is going to be whatever's happening and it's going to happen in the notifications panel so i'm going to call myself one more time and we're going to see what this one looks like now i am calling myself with the option of it only being inside of the notifications panel now this is the one that interferes with your gameplay the least but you still don't know if they're still calling you now if you do pull down the notifications panel twice you will be able to see who is calling you and you're able to answer and also decline so if you are looking for a way that it's able to not really interfere with your gameplay at all, you don't want to have a pop-up, anything like that, then you are able to choose that second option, which is going to be the one that is second, which is going to be the in notification only. So I hope that you guys have liked this video. If you guys did, please give this thing a huge thumbs up. Also, if you'd like to see the full review or the full tutorial of the game tools inside the game launcher, watch the very next uploaded video. I will go in depth and cover everything, but this one right here was something that I wanted to make its own small dedicated video. Make sure you guys hit on that subscribe button right over here. You can hit on the subscribe if there's something that you've learned or if you're brand new here at the channel of Jimmy is Promo. Share this video with your friends and family and social media sites. And outside of that, I'll see you guys later.